So I've been asked to do a meditation. Hi, everybody. So this meditation is going to be basically breaking down the prison that we've been in. And the way we do that is to raise our consciousness. But before we do that, I want to make sure everybody's well protected. So there's a lot of stuff going on right now. Entities and people that are kind of flipping around and lots of strange stuff. And while we're doing this, we don't want to be too visible. Okay. So basically I'm going to teach you guys how to do that for yourselves. And I'm going to ask that you just do this meditation over the next two days. So today and tomorrow. And you do it at your convenience. So we're not going to have one time where we all do it together. Because it's less visible that way. But it's still going to pack a punch. So what we're doing is we're raising our frequency. And this frequency raising is going to also help everybody around us. And this prison is built on frequency. So it's going to help that come down. It's already damaged. So we're going to work on getting it to be further damaged (laughs) and to start to thin. We want to see the truth. So that's what this meditation is about. So I want you to take a really deep breath and I want you to imagine that there's a little place behind your belly button and this is where your God spark or your spark from source lives. And this came from your mom. It came right through the umbilical cord. This is where your power lies. So we're going to work with energy today. So what I want you to think about is unconditional love. And everybody deserves unconditional love. So if you can just imagine that there's a small round bubble. And this bubble is about two inches across. And it lives right around your spark. So that little eternal flame that lives inside of you that connects you to God or source or whatever makes you comfortable, you're going to keep it protected. So just imagine a little pink bubble surrounding it, that little flame. And then we're going to make it grow. So this bubble is going to start to grow and it's going to be three inches, then four inches, then five inches, then 10 inches, and then it's going to be five feet and then it will be 10 feet. And that's where we're going to leave it at 10 feet all around our body, this bubble. And inside of this bubble is just this pink light. And that pink light is unconditional love. And that's unconditional love for you. Now, around this light, we're going to put another bubble. (laughs) So this bubble is going to be green. Green is the color I always see as protection. So think of the emerald. And that beautiful green that the emerald has in it. That's the color green that is going to be around the next bubble and inside of it. So you're just going to basically form this bubble. And it's going to be about 15 feet across. And it's going to be green. And your pink bubble is going to be inside of it. 
And I'll just give you a second to imagine that. And then when you're done, we're going to make two more bubbles. Okay. So one of them is going to be white light. So this white light is basically straight from God. And it's kind of like a twinkle light. Okay. So think of the light, the soft light that comes from the Christmas tree before there was the LED lights. So the natural white light. And then imagine it's sprinkled with gold dust. So you're going to have a bubble that's about 30 feet across. And it's going to be filled with white light and golden sparkles. And it's just going to form around your other two bubbles. And I'll let you think about that for one second. And last, we're going to create a mirror. So this bubble is going to be just like a mirror. So if you were looking in a mirror, just that, you know, reflective surface. Like liquid silver. And we're going to put this at about 40 feet across. And this is going to keep you from being seen. So go ahead and imagine your liquid silver bubble. No one can see inside of it. No entities. No bad guys. No AI. Nobody can see inside that bubble. Now, if you feel really comfortable, if you feel like you're safe, then I want you to continue on with this meditation. So, go ahead and close your eyes. Take another deep breath. And then I want you to imagine that you're stepping out your front door. And as you do, you see a field of green, deep, beautiful green, almost like your emerald bubble. And it feels fresh outside. It feels like it just rained. And the trees are green. Everything's a different shade of green all around you. There's no houses, only your own that you've walked out of. There's no roads. There's no buildings. It's just all nature. And you're going to walk to the middle of that field. And as you do, you're going to see a beautiful tree. This is the biggest tree that you've ever seen. And it almost glows in the sunlight. And it feels like that's the best place in the world to be, sitting under that tree. So go ahead and keep going. And then when you get there, have a seat. Sit down at the base of the tree. Lean against it. Feel thankful for this beautiful earth that we've been allowed to be on. Breathe it in and close your eyes. The tree will take you wherever you want to go. 
Let's imagine that you decide to travel to the ocean. And it's blue. Everywhere is blue. The white sand and the blue ocean. And you decide to swim. And you just get out a little ways. Maybe 10 feet. You're still touching the ocean floor. And you meet a dolphin. And you can understand what they have to say. And they say that they're there for you. They want to talk to you. You matter to them. You matter to everyone. We all matter together. We're all part of one team. Put your hand on the dolphin's head. And you can hear him inside of you. Telling you how happy he is that you understand him. How does that feel? They're the ambassadors to the higher beings that live in the ocean. Why are there higher beings in the ocean? They're there because they made a new home. Their frequency is high. We're moving forward into a higher frequency. The things that we're going to see are much different than what we see now. The colors will be brighter. The communication will be better. Everything will be easier because we will know deep within that we create our own reality. So let's step back out of the ocean and say goodbye to our friend and go back to the tree. And sit back down. Now sit for a bit after this ends and just imagine the life that you wish for. Imagine the beauty and then when you're done, when you've created all of the life that you're looking for, look as, as look at it as a slice of that life, a day. Like you're looking in at it. Whatever is your best life that you can imagine. And then create a doorway and step into it. And then open your eyes.